my god okay hi thoughties and welcome back to my crazy ass channel how are y'all doing today i hope you are doing amazing if you read the title right bitch you are probably jumping up in your chair excited or whatever and you probably also want to assault me through the screen okay so if you have been following me for a very long time, you know that I have this problem of starting Let's Plays and never finishing them. It is rare for me to make it to like part 15 of a series or something like that, and then I kind of just abandon it without even talking about it ever again. But today I thought it'd be fun to go through and look at all of my past save files and all of the little Let's Plays that I used to do on my channel. Voice crack, that was so sexy, wow. But if y'all are like interested in a certain Let's Play coming back, go ahead and like thumbs it up in the comments and let me know if you do want something to come back but I just lose interest so easily but okay what we're going to do is go ahead and scroll to the very bottom and oh my god the last time I played my thoughty to hottie save it was December 14th 2017 yo that's crazy I have not touched thoughty to hottie in that long wow so we're definitely going to start out with this let's play it and if you don't know what thoughty to hottie was well bitch it basically almost got my channel banned that's how crazy it was. I pretty much started out with a household of prostitutes. Ooh, girl, what should we do? Let's do winter because the hell never gets cold. But yeah, I started out with a bunch of prostitutes and basically like their whole goal was just to make it into a pet house and stuff like that. So who is even in this household? Like, I don't remember anybody. Who the fuck are y'all? <gasps> okay, I remember everybody now. Oh my God. Okay, it's all coming back to me. Let's go to the homeless hideout. So hang on, I could have sworn that I had them in like an actual house. I don't think they was homeless for this long, but apparently they're out here just being homeless prostitutes or whatever. And this is really what gave my channel subscribers. I mean, I had made a couple videos prior to doing this, but I was honestly pretending to be like family friendly, max match everything because I didn't think I would ever be able to grow in the Sims community saying bitch, pussy, fuck and stuff like that. But girl, we did it. But anyways, there was like a whole legacy basically. So this is Marilyn Ratchet. My founder sim for this challenge was called Kelly. And we were able to go like up here and see that that bitch is dead. Wait, what the fuck is going up with her? Is she like half aged up? Like, I don't get it. I don't know what's going on, but yeah, the whole point of this series was basically just to make them suck dick and get money and ends up getting into a penthouse. This was supposed to be season two of Thotty to Hottie, which I never finished because it was repetitive. Like the same episode, I'd be like, okay, you come over here, suck dick behind this tree. You go over here, suck dick by the water. And it was just so repetitive. Like 30 episodes of me just being like, hey, would you like some dick? Would you like some coochie? over and over again so yeah i can definitely see why i ended this challenge i mean i'm lucky youtube did not ban me for even posting this because i used to post wicked whims without a single sensor on it so yeah i'm pretty lucky but okay let's go ahead and take a look at the uh next let's play okay so it looks like the next one is pets okay i barely have any recollection of doing a pets let's play this is going to be so ugly bitch i haven't done seasons for any of these okay fall because brindleton bay is like the fall town bitch isn't it by the way i'm pretty sure we're having university come soon but wait who are you guys who the fuck are you mariana and max like i don't remember y'all i remember i started out with this house yes this is who i was doing okay i was doing the hundred kitten challenge i completely forgot oh my god all right so how this let's put why the hell don't you got shoes on? And who is this? This is the kitten challenge, not the wrinkly dog challenge. But anyways, the way this let's play worked was that this guy over here, he used to live with his mama. He was a real mama's boy, but she fucking did. She was a crazy cat lady, like some old bitch or whatever. But yeah, she passed away. And this is literally how far I got with the 100 kitten challenge. <laughs> like one birth. What a fail. Oh my God. And somehow I got a dog. I don't really know. But I wanted her to have like the pinkest, cutest house. And clearly I never gave that to her. And then she kind of just died. And that was the whole series and i think i made him have a kid didn't i or like he fucked a stripper or something like that damn he fucked a bunch of bitches but uh yeah this was probably like one of my worst let's plays ever i think i made this when i had maybe like 15,000 subscribers and it was just so shitty like you can still probably find it on my channel and everything it's just fucking trash like this was the worst let's play ever like i just literally want to forget all about it wait do mods still work yes they do i just had a freaking sim update but bitch you were getting lightning striked because you were that boring like i tried to run a boring ass vet clinic and i was like i can do this i'll be fine like i'm so family friendly guys but yeah i'm trash at doing let's plays like this okay let's go to the next one 
I'm going to cry. Oh my God. This is probably my favorite Let's Play I've ever done, you guys. Let's do summer for this one. Ooh, I have so many houses. I really don't know which one to start out with. We have this one, which is like where they were drug dealing. We have like so many family members everywhere. I don't know which household to start out in. Okay, let's start out in this one because my son got the bag. Sammy. Oh my God. I remember everybody so well. I'm going to cry. Y'all, let me know down below if you ever watch my parenthood Let's Play. Oh my god, he fucking bald, but let's forget about that. This Let's Play was the most fun I have ever had in The Sims, period. Back when I started this on my channel, I think that was when I was the most addicted to The Sims 4, and I genuinely enjoyed it so much at this point. Like, I was honestly playing off camera all the time, and I couldn't wait to wake up and play with this family. Like, I loved it so much, but okay. Let me basically run it down for you if you never watched this again, but pretty much, I started out by just making a mixed family create a sim. That's how this whole Let's Play started. So daddy right here, this is Landon. He was a super chill Asian dad. So he was Asian and then his wife was black. I can't, I can't find her in the thing. There she is, Cassidy. And she was definitely a lot more strict. Like they were opposite parents. So he was always chill. And with the parenthood options, he was always given like the good things. And Cassidy was a little bit more stricter. And then basically daddy Landon over here came out as bisexual. And he explained that like he wanted to play with his sexuality a little bit. And then him and his wife unfortunately got a divorce. But like, look how much stuff we did in the whole like family and everything. Like Layla over here, she was the first born and she was so bad. Like her entire teenage years, she was sneaking out to get tattoos. She was sneaking out to go with her girlfriend and go out. And then she actually had two children with her girlfriend. And then we have Sammy right here who was actually a teen dad. I don't know why the heck he's bald, but basically the day he lost his virginity, he got a bitch pregnant and then they had to move out. He had to turn to drug dealing, but look what drug dealing gets you, bitch. A beautiful house. Oh, you can't even see it. But yeah, the last time I played this was Christmas last year. So yeah. I kind of want to go into the other household because this was just Sammy where he went ahead and, you know, started his own life where he got this fiance right over here. And she has a little daughter as well. Why does everybody have such negative traits? <laughs> she might not live in this town unless I'm just missing something. Wait, does she live here? Yes, she lives there. Look, they all got their Christmas sweaters on and shit. Damn, every bitch is bald. Oh shit, I just visited them. I didn't change the household, but okay, let's have her go ahead. Knock on this door. Hello, go ahead and meet your auntie. Oh my God, look at the kids and everything. Like y'all, I am geeked up right now. I have not seen this household in a year and like it's all coming back to me. So over here, I think this is Zane. Oh no, that's Reese. Okay, Zane and Reese were twins. They were born like mid in the LP and now they're living with their big sister. And oh my God, it was just such a huge like legacy and everything. Like there's kids everywhere just playing. Oh my God. And there's freaking Cassidy. She is the mother that like started everything still looking young as hell like hey bitch i see you still got that same booty and everything girl but yeah she is the mom and like grandmother to everybody so where's layla i need to see her because i'm so obsessed where is my girl layla where are you oh there she is oh my god yes layla she's right over here so this was honestly like my favorite this was my favorite time to play with period like she is just such a good time She's so beautiful and she was just such a baddie like she was always down to party She was always down to do some bad things We was always partying sneaking out and shit like that But now she's a mom and super responsible her girlfriend should be around here somewhere unless they broke up I honestly cannot remember but I know for a long time She had a girlfriend and then this was the last uh, baby to be born She's just a teenager still and she had a sugar daddy and all this shit But genuinely I had so much fun with this let's play I cannot even even start like the drama honey it was so much fun but yeah let's go ahead and see what else i have <gasps> y'all know who this bitch is but like that's an outdated version isn't it that's like an outdated ass version of jolene and then we got this swingers let's play that like i literally only did one episode of so i don't think that's fair where's my like jolene jolene one there it is, Breed Out the Ugly. Or is that Breed Out the Ugly season two? No, that's gotta be Breed Out the Ugly season one. <gasps> there she is, Jolene just fucking chilling, bitch, with her makeover, girl. Looking all cute or whatever. 
All right, so if you never watched Breed Out's Ugly Challenge, basically this bitch used to be is so fucking ugly. Don't even start with me, bitch. She was like intense. She was an ugly bitch. And I know so many people get offended when I say ugly. But girl, like there's nothing wrong with that. I wouldn't care if someone called me ugly. I'd rather be called ugly than weird. Like, I'm sorry, but I see every simmer do the Breed Out the Weird Challenge. And like, I would rather just be called ugly than weird. And that's the tea. But basically, look at this fucking legacy, bitch. We had a crazy, time with this let's play basically the whole part was she kept having babies with a bunch of different baby daddies and then she had an evil twin that came out of nowhere and then we finally beat the challenge on this generation i think yeah damn why is all y'all dead what the hell yeah this was such a fun let's play and oh my god like so many of the kids just looked so cute and like they're still toddlers for the most part yeah we definitely beat the challenge with this household her name was jolene as well and she was the one to go ahead and like get rid of the curse of the ugly i really want to see jolene's evil twin sister but like look how many dudes she fucked what a queen she got so many men but i'm trying to find jojo okay her evil twin i think i'm going to have to change the relationship or like she's literally not going to come over we got to make them best friends again just so that she'll want to come over so i am just going to speed up but yeah you can see all her relationships and stuff like that and oh my god that is so funny that she made this gumbo because when we were playing this let's play basically the only food that the kids would eat was birthday cake and beans okay that was their beautiful well-balanced diet but he was kind of cute too oh my god who the fuck are you like what the hell is a fledging vampire and that's her grand kitty what the heck <laughs> i can't remember any of these people but yeah there's a lot of but there's a lot of crazy shit that happened in this let's play i mean some episodes are deleted just because again wicked whims shit i'm an idiot i know y'all hate me i'm sorry but wicked whims is the fucking devil like i use it to see some sim titties and stuff like that and then i paid the price when youtube was like girl what are you trying to do always oh, seems like jojo is in the area so let's look for her where is miss jojo at hmm jojo oh there she is look at this bitch okay so this is basically like what jolene looked like when we first started the challenge before she got all her plastic surgery and everything but yeah this this is her evil twin and they like always fought each other like they was always attacking shit so yeah i mean braid out the ugly was hella fun i really wanted to do like a third season of this but i always lose interest i always lose interest and i'm like every episode is the fucking same but, oh my god yes y'all so cute or whatever damn twinsies let's become best friends even though you guys tried to punch each other in the face like a million times but let's be best friends Yay! This guy looks so awkward. He's like, bitch, um, y'all gonna order something? Oh, she did. There we go. All right, let's see. What the heck else do we have in my save files? What else do I have? I have SimSol, but I kind of want to, like, save that for later. I don't know yet. I have the island one. That was so boring. What the fuck did I even do in here? What the fuck is going on? Like, I forgot this bitch had some type of island illness. Like, I don't know what happened, but she got cursed or something like that. But yeah, this Let's Play was based around around the Salvador Ada pack. Why don't you got pants on? Oh my God. Oh, what? They were sucking his dick on the low. Like, bitch, don't even play with me. What the hell? Her ass and vagina are out. I just saw Sim fucking body parts. Put your clothes on, Cosette. But yeah, basically, I did a little Thoughts in the Jungle LP where they went ahead and they had some fun. They got to go to the jungle. Look at this little hoe. She was my favorite. Cosette would fuck anything that would move. And she's just such a queen. She's so pretty. And then for the last episode, I just put a bunch of Dolly Partons in here. I don't really know why, but like all of y'all are supposed to be Dolly Parton. And they basically just sang Jolene, 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 Jolene. I have not done that in like a year and that was horrible. I'm sorry. Yeah, I mean, I feel like this let's play was fun, but I really didn't like the jungle expansion thing. And it's like you go through the temple like maybe one time and then there's just no point in doing it again. But yeah, I mean, basically they all took a little trip on the tour guide's dick because because what else do you do when you're in the jungle and you're horny, Taddy? He was sexy. He was so cute. Oh my god. And especially having all these Dolly Partons was so lit. But I mean, I think the world of Salvador 
Nevada is beautiful, don't get me wrong, but I'm really not into fucking like clearing paths with hands. I'm more into like, you know, clearing your bitch's nut for you. So it just really wasn't my style, but it was a fun couple episodes, definitely. So y'all, if you are in the mood to cry, go ahead and cry with me. But this was pretty much my runaway teen pregnancy challenge. And I did kind of like lose hope on this series too. I don't know why, like I always fall in love with this story and then I just never play it again. But basically right over here was my girl Sky. We started the let's play off with her being completely bald. She had shaved her head just because obviously like being a teen mom and getting kicked out is super traumatic. And it was just a lot. But basically she ran into like this little abandoned hotel. She helped fix it up and all this stuff. And then basically things happened. Winter aged up into a child now and she's so beautiful. She's healthy. Look at those little rosy cheeks. She's so cute. And I remember on like episode two, I promised Sky and Winter that I would give them the best Christmas ever. It was not the tea. Basically, they didn't have any gifts. They didn't really have anything to celebrate. But I gave them like a little Christmas setup and I wanted to do a Christmas episode, but I, I kind of forgot about it, I guess. But I got them all dressed up in like Christmas outfits. Like I gave all of them the cutest little looks just so that they could have a family Christmas celebrate. Really, bitch? <laughs> Christmas celebration together. They all have their own little outfits and stuff like that. Yeah, basically Sky went ahead and she said, fuck these fuck boys. And she got herself a girl, okay? And this is her beautiful girlfriend. She's thick, she beautiful, and they're co-parenting together. So she was also a teen mom to this little girl called Joanna. And then obviously we have winter and then they just have a little doggy together. I think they had a cat too, but like it ran away. Sorry. And I never even finished furnishing their house. Like I'm just such a bad Sims player. I just kind of abandoned them, but you know, at least we got to have a lot of memories. I mean, we even went on vacation with Sky and winter, but winter never got to meet her daddy. Did she? I don't think she's ever met her dad. Not once. <laughs> But, you know, I like to think they're happy in here living in their little house together. They don't have to worry about money. Sky got her shit together. And, you know, Christmas, celebration, happiness. Uh oh, back again, back to back paint, back stack the M's. I don't know, I think we've seen pretty much everything though. Who are you? Yeah, that's my 100 baby mama challenge too that I didn't get to do. <gasps> Ratchet princesses, how could I forget? Oh my God. Y'all, what the fuck? Why is this bitch so ugly? I can't remember, what did I do to them? What the fuck did I do to them? Yo, I like ruined the whole let's play. Oh yeah, I freaking, oh my God, okay, so. On like the last episode of Ratchet Princesses, I decided to put a curse on them just so that we could work with like the Ratchet villains as well. And they put like the curse of the ugly on them, but we never freaking, oh. <laughs> we oh, never oh, fucking yeah. fixed the curse, bitch. And like Aurora was the only one that wasn't attacked by it because like Maleficent liked Aurora, I guess. It's so confusing. Like girl, I don't even remember why I did half this shit, but we got Jasmine, we got Elsa, um, Tiana, Ariel, Aurora, and then Pocahontas and Mulan. Snow White was the only bitch that died actually because she had a cocaine overdose and that was actually kind of sexy, you know? But they have this beautiful little penthouse and everything and then we also have the ratchet villains that made them ugly as shit bitch but yeah we have like ursula who else do we have ursula maleficent and um that old lady from snow white and then i think there's one more person but we also had like prince charming and then we had like rapunzel and everything but we killed all those bitches and for a while i think this let's play was really fun i mean we should probably do a crossover episode and like make them go see the her titties was out, but yeah, we gotta go make them see the brats or something like that. And I'm pretty sure most of them had kids too, right? Like, Elsa, did you have a baby? I think she had a baby, didn't she? This shit game doesn't want to load. Like, hello? Like, hello? Like, hello? Yeah, it's not gonna work. Okay. Well, that fucking sucks. Okay, well, this one is called Buggy Simself, so I think that's, like, my most recent Simself one. Hopefully it will load. I mean, normally if I put, like, Buggy or Glitch in the file name, it just means it's not gonna load, but... Oh, it worked, bitch! So this is my Simself. I really want to do an updated Simself um, Let's Play because it's been, like, a year and a half since I've done one, but basically the whole town is my children. Like, and hey, yo, these bitches is my sons, and I'm talking about sperm dough. Actually, I am talking about sperm, okay? But yeah, where am I? I don't even know where I live. I have like 
10,000 baby daddies. Like, all my kids live up in the city and shit like that. So I guess we'll just play as my kids because I can't find anyone else. Oh, my child is at the strip club. Very nice. Ah, so these are all my babies. And apparently my baby had a baby. I, I have no memory of this. Like, I just can't remember this Let's Play for the life of me. But pretty much I started this himself. Let's Play out. Where am I? Carmen King. I had a shit ton of kids like what the fuck i don't even remember having half of them but basically when i started this let's play out i really wanted it to be a serious let's play and make it kind of like how i would actually act in real life but then it turned into just a mess bitch it turned into such a mess on like episode five i think and i think on like episode two i ate ass or something like that i can't remember but all these kids is mine everybody had like grandkids too all my babies just going everywhere and yeah they're all with like a bunch of different dads so I think that was so much fun to do, but I definitely want to do it all over again. Like just do a SimSelf series. So let me know if y'all want another SimSelf series. I mean, I'm gonna be real with y'all. I definitely believe that within seven to 10 days, we're going to have a new Sims trailer coming up for either a new game pack or expansion pack. That's just me, by the way. Like I don't have any inside information. I'm not a game changer. Disclaimer, I haven't heard anything, but it has been like three months since they've released any type of paid content. So I'm thinking we're gonna have something really big coming up. And I believe Pixelade has just uploaded a video talking about why it's gonna be university or something like that i don't know i haven't watched it yet but i believe that our next sim pack is going to be coming out within a month so i want to do a sims of let's play if it fits the pack but yeah we'll just have to see but anyways that is about it i just want to say thank you guys so much for putting up with my bullshit for the oh my god putting up with my bullshit for these past couple years because i know how annoying it is the fact that i never finished let's plays and that i don't know i just lose interest in everything that's the type of person that i am i cannot do the same thing Thing ever like it just depends on what mood I'm in but if you guys want to type in the comment section and tell me some let's plays that maybe you miss or you would like to see a little spin-off version of we could definitely do something fun with that I think for sure yeah it's all just depending on what you guys want so if you see a comment kind of relating to something that you like to go ahead and just thumbs it up Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and go now, but I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up. Talk to me in the comment section down below and subscribe if you have not already, and I will talk to y'all tomorrow. So goodbye, thoughties!